Okie dokie. When we left us off with Age of Empires, that's not the name, Age of Wonders 4, got it, first try. Um, I trusted the orcs to be friends, and it turns out the orcs, they don't want to be friends, because the orcs decided to encroach on my land by outposting literally, like, right next door to me? And now, I should have known, I am a dwarf, we don't trust the filthy greenskins. Now we gotta kill the orcs. Cause he also has like, I just, I think he just has his single lord. Game. Game. Capture. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you. There you go. Yeah, there's my weird decrepit wizard I was talking about before to try a uh, single player with. And I got a unicorn immediately. And I remade her three times. Cause I was testing stuff. Hello, dwarfs! Yay! What's this one? Your current mod is different for those the game was saved with. I'm not. You have outdated versions of the following mods. I shouldn't. Didn't Steam update those automatically? Steam. What you doing, buddy? 28 megabytes completed today at 2.55 p.m. Uh-huh. I don't... Oh, I'm dumb. It's it's that the mod's updated, but it's detecting an older version of the mod. So it's going, hey, uh, these are not the same version. Yes, they're updated. It's a color palette and big world. It's fine. Let's go noiter ourselves. Some orc. He only had, I think he has a city that he expanded to. Yeah, look, look at this. Here's my capital. Here's the garden. There he is. Kill! Craig, where are you? Craig, 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 grab your army, kill. Uh, other person. How many heroes can I have? Do I have too many heroes? No. Well, yes, by one. But still. <coughs> Lady. Uh. So I have been doing one thing wrong, which is I need to be doing a lot more outposts because I don't think there's a limit to a num the number of outposts you can have, but there is to cities. So, like, I don't think I can grab this. I, I get, yeah, this is three separate provinces. So there's, so there's no way for me to, like, have two outposts and grab everything here. But, I can outpost there. <coughs> and get me some cool stuff. I think we were at the end of the turn. No, we weren't. Oh, find me. Find me rock and stone. What is this? Oh, also, um, there's auto explore. There's a button for that. I want to know if they auto prospect as well? I don't have a free city available for negotiations. I ate it. He's mine. He's nice. Arbalist Market, Kragmar. Sorry, Kragmar. It's not Kragmar. You'd think with dwarves it would be Kragmar. It's Craig. Why Craig? Who Craig? What? Craig! Okay, uh, Kragmar does not have a lot of... <coughs> or any quarries. So none of these are very good. Right now. Oh, it requires two farms. I should get on that. And get the mint. That runs all of my money out, though. That was definitely some manner of English. 
and you're making them mint and building a lot more stuff. Build less stuff because I want to queue up Craig. Also building a mint because money and maybe tavern because stability gives me extra food, which makes people want to fuck harder, which makes me able to annex more land. A friendship with you was declared. What do you mean a friendship with me was declared? He is trespassing on the rightful dwarven clay! And I have a word justification for him. Like, once I'm over here with my two armies, him dead. I'm going to kick him out of my stuff. Get. Get out of here. Go on, get. Get. Yeah. I don't want to declare war too soon. Because I don't know what fancy schmancy wizard powers he has to just come over here and explode all of my new stuff and cool stuff. Can I make you into a city? You are being made into a city. Okay, Craig, assemble. Please tell me you will auto-prospect if I do this. You sit there. Because they do have the whole prospecting thing going on. But I, I know they'll grab, like, stuff that's not being guarded. Which is neat. Which, yes, they do grab stuff. You don't have to have a hero. You can do it with a scout. And I've been ignoring that because I didn't think it was possible. Because one time I couldn't move on to the tile and I went, Oh, that must be a thing! No, it wasn't. Who is this? Are you purple because... No, yeah, purple would be another faction, right? Because the gray ones are... Shitties. Come down here. Let me see the new friends. Are you a person? Yes. Reign of the Golden. You don't look golden. You look like a frog. You look like you're made of rock and stone, which I need to do. Are you also... Undergroundy? <gasps> you are undergroundy. Here, have some $50. We can be friends with the froggies. They are short, squat. It's a much sturdier design than the stupid orcs. Do I want to be friends? I can't make you immediately... No, I'm poor is why I can't make you immediately friend. That's okay. We're automatically friends because we share a love of rock and stew. Speaking of rock and stone... Yeah, I can turn all of my dwarves into whatever the hell was going on with her, which is having stone skin. Rock and stone skin, perhaps. Compliments you on my actions and proves me for 50 things. You're doing great! Sir, this is not going to save you from the punishment, the thunder about topping. Go on, Craig, bring the thunder. Oh yeah, I need to go kill these spiders, don't I? I got 13 turns to do that. Hello. War. You declare war on Noctis, depending on your war justification balance. Relations with other rulers of cities may be affected. I gained 10 evil? Because he hasn't hurt me enough? God damn it! All right, you. You gonna have this time, buddy? Okay, are you gonna automatically prospect this? I don't think so, cause they have it queued up to do that, which means I should probably just. Explore on my own dang self. <coughs> Let me actually look that up. Uh, Age of Wonders for Auto Prospect. Does it work? Auto Explore Prospect. Uh, nobody cares. 
or has asked. I could ask, but I'm lazy. I don't wanna. <laughs> Damn it. Can I, like, demand you unoutpost this? Ye fucker. Can I do that? Can I settle a grievance? Like, get rid of this outpost. You're already on my rightful dwarven clay. Fuck off. Yeah. No, I don't want him to pay just $60. I want him to abandon. Get out. Get out of my land. Rightful dwarven clay. Can I, like, buy the outpost from him? I can give him Kragmar. I can't give him outposts. What do you have for items? Ooh. Murder ring. Ooh. I don't know what it does. Here we go. Oh! Craig does have a mount. 20% damage per hex traveled, cancels defense mode, removes retaliation, 60% chance of inflicting poison. Do you want that? I can't afford that. Can I buy it from you with magic? I don't, I don't use magic much. No, he wants monies. Get out of my land. Fuck you. Treaties. Uh, give me your shit. Damn it. Can I get more grievances if I, like, denounce him? You mean I don't have any grievance that can be used for this action? He is settling by me. I want to be alone. I need my space. Social distancing. Fuck you. Blech. I'm sure he'll, like, expand his outpost and it'll give me another grievance. And then I can boop him on the noggin. Alright, you go handle the spoders. And you go handle whatever this quest was. Additional spatters. Seven turns? What is wrong with your movement speed? Forest? Yeah. Can I build roads? You can build roads or a robot. You can name on the army panel. Roads are built on hexes. Cost three dollars. Probably do that. Craig, build a road. Can you build roads? Hmm. Do we already have a road going from Craigmar to normal place? No, not quite. Go road. Oh, I think we did have a road, because now we have like conflicting wiggity woogity hexes. I can't tell if this is a road or not. Like, this is obviously a road. What the heck is going on here, though? This is all just muddled up. Oh, well. Do you have any prospectees near you? And how did you get over there? I guess you went just straight across the mountain. I feel like you should go around that. Ooh, they are dwarves, though. They seventy dollars. Wait, did you prospect? Or did you pick up seventy bucks from the from the dollar store? Your first city. Does Craig not count? Are we ignoring Craig? I guess I didn't found Craig, did I?
<laughs> Palisade, a good dwarven name. Gimme. Aw, oh, fishies. That's not very good. Oh yeah, I was coming over here to beat these dudes up. Let's do that first. Get off my land! Ow, that's a lot of auto combat. Yeah, we're fine. The ships approach the bird, the mercenary guards, they raise the light flag. We're hired by a rich virtue looking in a mana node. We expect to protect from roaming scoundrels, not against a full fledged assault. Please accept our surrender and let us go. How about we change your contract and you serve me? I can hire the dwarves! If I have a river that you get an anvil guardian. 120 gold? Now I'm good. Go in peace. Or whatever. He died. He fell over and died. That doesn't seem very in peace. Oh. Risky battle, you say. Ooh, astral weirdos. What are you even guarding there? Yeah, okay, manual combat. Sounds good. Ooh. I assume they're guarding crystals. Judging by all of the crystals. Okay, I think we focus these guys if we can. Uh, how do I want to set this up? Archers on the ridge. Let them come to us. Good Tic Tacs. I figured out what the half moon or the crescent moons do. It's uh, for every available mana that they have, they can attack an extra time, which is why they go up and they just beat the shit out of people. <gasps> I'm a good boy now. Does that do anything for me? Does it just make other good boys like me and bad boys not like me? Yay! Give us a chance a random event will to be positive. Nice. Can you not hit down there? Hmm. Shield wall men. Punch them in the dick. Huzzah! I probably should use their defense action, huh? Yeah, these guys got a defense action and a dog. Oh, that's their dog. My worry is that this guy will just come around here, but I don't think... Oh, that's a battle mage. It doesn't have to go around there. Um... Hmm. Yeah, no, those are my spells. Come and get us, assholes! Defense. Ow. Stunned? That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. They have a higher range than us? That's not good at all. Oh, dear God. You know, I thought more of those were going to be melee than actually were. Maybe I should have known by the melee marker and the wizard marker. Oops. Um. I can't believe they have higher range than our archers. Fuck you, dudes. Ooh. Run over here. Do not die. Yeah, shoot. Do the thing. There you go. Three dollars. Nice. Does it just explode into goop? What does stun to do? Does it just take one of your action points or you can't do anything? You can't do anything. Great! Huh. 
I can cast magic. Hee hee. Definitely want that. No, no. Four retaliation. No, no. Hit the bird. There's a spooky ghost. Here. That's that's spooky. Okay, this might actually be a tough fight if I can't kill the mages. Um, and I can't kill the mages because they outrange my range, which hurts real bad when they do that thing there. All right, not going to them was a mistake. He is in range of my other dudes now, though. That's something. <laughs> Can I retry this, but with the auto battle and see how it does decides to do it? Probably don't get your hero dude man stunned. Oh, can I taunt him? No! I can move there and taunt this guy. Can I taunt him? What is my range? I cannot reach. Will I be able to reach? Oh, okay. Uh, so their taunt is melee range. His taunt is rangey range. I'll have to be able to get over here, which I can't. For some reason. Is that a battlement I had to destroy? Are you still out of range? Are you kidding me, dude? He was out of range over here, moves up, and is still out of range. Do they outrange me by two? Yes, they do. What the fuck? Why am I not rangey? Run away! Shoot the bird! Actually, don't shoot the bird. I can, I can kill the bird with my dude. Nice! I would have attacked him if he was in range, but he was not. Alright, do you have a heal? Yes. What are the odds that this guy walks up here and then immediately blasts my dude? Probably likely. They apparently have half the map as their playground. Ooh. Ooh. All right, that's all I can do. Can launch a spell. All I have for spells. Bolstering champ might be really good on my dude here now, because doesn't he have, like, yeah, four bolster defense? I'll do it next turn, because if he gets hit this turn, he'll still have the bolster. Then I can probably wipe the dog. Ow. Please don't. Okay, I didn't get I didn't get stunned. Which would have also been a waste of the bolster thingy. Ow! My dudes! Okay, thank god I'm not focusing the animal guard. It 
You get back here. Ow. They're hazing me to death. Ah, oh, fuck. I should have done the big attack. It doesn't default to that. Ow! Oh, there's friendly fire. Nice. Um, maybe I want to do the heal on my anvil guard. Or more bolster defense. Steel Fury. Oh, that applies to everybody. I don't want it to apply to everybody, but holy shit is this guy almost dead. Not entirely dead, but almost dead. Hee <laughs> donk. He might be dead with the critical hits, because he has a 70% bonus chance to crit with that. Uh... Yeah, you dick. <laughs> Come here, you fuckers. Oh. Oh, it's spooky. Do I want to go over here and smack these guys? Not really, because if they gang up on this animal guard, him dead. I want to go back here with him <laughs> and deep it. <laughs> God damn it! Are you fucking kidding me? That guy has chain lightning? For a standard warlock unit? Well, there goes all of my shit. Cool. He has chain lightning. Never before has it used chain lightning. Yeah, electrifying arc. Cool. Holy shit, dude. For a tier 2 unit? You get a big fuck off AoE like that? Well, rip all my dudes. Fuck it. Do I get to keep the buff thing I did before? Like the, the damage? I don't think I have it anymore. No, no, wait, I do. Kill! He takes no fucking damage. How is this a tier 2 unit? Uh -huh. You have one defense. And I do jack shit. Rude. Yeah, get crit, bitch. Nice. This guy's just going to focus down. Or they're both going to focus down my range. 36? Where are you getting this all of a sudden? Oh. Physical ranged magic. Base physical range and magic attacks of all attacking units is plus three. Oh. That's why they can hit me from half a map away. What the fuck was the... 30 damn 30 that's Jesus Christ <coughs> Can I kill this if I attack it? No, because you're stunned now or something or engaged in whatever. <laughs> Ow. Mistakes were made. You just bolster here? Yeah, fuck you. Well, there goes half my army. And there are my good ranked up units. Did you just eat your friend? Or my guy? What are you? Yeah, you better run. Anyway, they're running because they can't cast there. 
Claim victory now. No! Kill! Vengeance for the fallen! Vengeance! Magic blast! Damn it. <laughs> I don't think he can move without getting... No, never mind. We don't get attacks of opportunities, I guess. Oh, I lost my strongest and... Use oh. shit. What the fuck was that damage? It's not, it's most, it's not really the damage. It's the range. Because holy shit, the range on those. Getting an extra three. That was ridiculous. So normally they're supposed to be one or two shorter range than my archers, but no. Ow! It's better be worth it. What the hell did I even get here? Magic materials. Yeah, all right. That's like a super special resource or something. To buy all of my nice, higher-ranked arbalists. You have what does even do? Yeah, yeah. You have selected a unit. No shit! It's a lot of... health. And, and whatever the metal does. Eh. Plus one defense. Okay, you could have just put plus one defense on here, you know. Be stonemason, palisade, 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 palisade. Here you go. Craig, why are you not in Craigmar? Here you go. Craig is in Craigmar. I can also just assign Craig to this, which probably also re removes him from Craigmar. No, 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 no. Craig stays in Craig. Craig, remain Craig. Do I get a new here with each city? I do. Okay. Okay, that gives that a road. You go back to Craig. Hmm. I could get chain lightning. That's not chain lightning. That's a weak baby version. Or whatever it was. This is all magic stuff. We don't need no stinking magic. We just need to smack them harder. Fengard. Oh, well, you can't be me. I'm already me. Only one soul inhabits this body at a time. <laughs> oh, what's this? Ooh, additional. The summon undead. So there's three random tier one undead units. Is that a spell? Yeah. It's just an ability I can use in game. Friendly units in one tile gain big, big, and big. I can summon animal. I can explode! There's 30% damage to all units in a two hex radius. That's 24 damage with a six range. <coughs> Star blades. Strongeth. Teleport and deals damage. That might be cool, but that sounds like magic stuff. Disgusting, filthy magic stuff.
What does the blue mean? Like the darker blue. I kind of want Frostfire Detonation. Because that's big dams. In a 2 hex radius, too. That's huge dams. Ooh. Mana Unchained might be cool, too. Because it gives elemental damage. And also just gives them 20% extra damage. Oh, this increases the, um... Doohickeys I get, too. Shoot! Okay, um... Yeah, definitely Frostfire. <coughs> now he can explode! Wait, does that mean Craig can explode? Craig, you're level 5, right? Craig? Craig, what do you got? Oh. Craig gets a different one. Interesting. I wonder if those are random. It's just one per one random one per thingy. Climate has changed to good. Okay. Palisade has been founded. Craig has a stone. Go kill the spouters. How you doing tonight, Hobo? It's a flanker based command for B Lame Fenguard. How do you get it so that it's, uh. I'm assuming it, you meant to put a space there, and, it, and the command is exclamation point B space, and then the person's name. Or how would you get it to incorporate the, the username into the command without it being, like, one per individual person? Having to be custom made. Ew, gross. In tier 3? Jesus. Like I've made custom commands for every special unit, so it is just doing each individually. Okay. Alright, moment of truth. What's over here? I don't know, because it's not the moment of truth yet. And holy crap, moving underground sucks ass. So I have woefully ignored the, uh... Looking at the at the, the race trait list in order to get... I think there's a wall, that's why there's nothing there. In order to make my dwarves exist underground. Your claimed province has been captured. You now have 25 grievance against Noctis. Finally! War! Uh -huh. After I... Get my army back. Hang on. You too. C come back. Come to me. It is time for war! Yeah. No, not the city. The army! Yes, good. We'll have two support people, but that's not necessarily bad. They can make it work. The war! Ooh. Wood. Go get the wood. Is there something on that? Go get the wood. God damn it. That's why she didn't get the wood. Alright, you clear the spoders and then regroup for war! We could just go take his capital city. We'd have to invade the underground. But it is possible. Do I want to boost my population here? I think I need a, another farm. Or something. I got the two foresters for the armory. <laughs> I need four farms for that. I could build another farm, like, out here, and then convert this to a quarry, which would get me another doodle bop. And I think I actually kind of want to focus... Eh, bathhouse might be a good idea. 
because city stability just gives me a percentile bonus to all of my income, which might be better than... It's not going to be better than two income per farm. Although I need two farms. And also one guild allowed per city. Hmm. Which I probably want to be like the Quarrier's Guild. Yeah. Because I'm going to have a lot of quarries here. Bath house. Where the peoples can get naked. Yeah, this is just a wall over here. I do have the thing that lets me dig through earth. Can I do that here? Cannot move on this terrain. But I have the thing. Like, this is bedrock. This is earth. I feel like I should be able to diggy diggy hole through it. Excavate earth and terrain. In your head. Does that not let me dig through the tunnels underground like the third game? Does it just let me turn earth and terrain into something else? Rocky. Mm hmm. I got no fucking clue. Denounce this man! It cost me a hundred mana. Grr, 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 grr. Ignored my claims on a province. He fucking outposted on my province. Point at him! Point at him and laugh! Fuck you! That's a grudgeon! Declaration of friendship. No! You wanna be friends? You're far enough away, right? <laughs> Maybe. Friendship with the orcs is over. Now the frog people are my new best friends. A wizard's bond. Uh... It's a deal. Damn it, I'm too poor to be your friend. I'm sorry. I'm too busy building glorious dwarven industry. And in two turns, I can turn all my rock and stones into... I'm sorry, eagle mount? Does that make me fly? Yeah. Are you going to do that? No. Okay, so they do not auto-prospect. That sucks. Can I set them to auto prospect? Oh, here we go. Oh, god damn it. Fuck off. I'm reading stuff. Something, something. Uh. Harvest festival. I can collect taxes, become nice, receive a lot of shit. Or have city stability. I want this one. His visual has any need to dig in an area of earth and terrain to province. Will open up new paths, uncovered, buried treasure, or even discover hidden locations. Is that what this is? Province cannot be excavated. Okay. I have no clue what that means. All right, so I do want to do my scouts manually then. Because they don't auto process. Jesus Christ! How much do you die in auto combat? All of it. Let's not. We're not using the natural dwarfly defenses. No, they just keep shitting out spiders. Okay. Uh, I'm thinking we back up to here and bottleneck them. Assuming they hopefully can't spit at me. Yeah, they probably just ran up and got 
surrounded. I should have done the autoplay. So you can actually autoplay the uh, AI battles. Oh, I was going to give... Well, I wasn't going to give you it. I need to give my main guy his sweet flying eagle. Put a defensive line here. Problem is, if I try to bottleneck them here, they'll just go around this way. Uh. Wish I could see every hex on the map. Is there a way to put them to do that? Not sure you can go past this. So maybe we do just bunch up here and then we have two fronts. Because then that'll be they can only fit two to attack me here. And then like one or two here only. <laughs> can't cast spells, can I? Oh, no, wait, I need to wait a couple turns, don't I? Okay, that's fine. God, they're so gross and spidery. Yeah, yeah you can't go past this. So that's not terrible, actually. If we just... I guess set these two guys up here? Yeah. Here and here. Because then they can only fit two there, maybe? Or they have to go there, which might force them to retreat. Which I don't know if it is as a thing or not, but probably should have put this guy over here because the bulk of their army is going to like mash against that or something. Stolen skin. Make them very defensey. bolster defenses stay for the entire combat. I don't think I've ever seen those wear off. We're gonna make these guys real beefy. Oh, it says three turns right there. I'm I'm smart. I wish I could have people swap areas. What I could do is when they, if they like bunch up here, because it doesn't look like they're trying to go around, I can go around and flank, which I don't think is going to be as effective as I think it is. Because this is not total war. Like, that'd be great if this were total war, and oh no, they have ranged. Hopefully they only have, like, one of those. Well, they are spiders. How much crap do you have to shit? <laughs> Get over here. Fuck you. Alright, well, if we die horribly, the lesson will be learned. Um, This will get him surrounded very, very fast.
I can always replay it, right, if I fuck this up. Can I see what you have ahead of time? Melee strike. Web. Barbed webs. Frozen webs? Oh. They're all sticky icky. Gross. Alright, maybe we maybe we start a, a wee bit flanking. Because they'll be focused on these guys. Maybe. <laughs> um... Yeah, no, they're just gonna keep standing there and spitting webs over and over, aren't they? <laughs> oh no, hey, hey, coming in to oh. Maybe they can only use web once, which was is kind of my hope. Um Uh oh. These guys are fucking badasses right now, though. Can I get to this to smite it? Technically. No. You're really frozen frozen? Like, literally can't do anything frozen? I sure wish it were more convenient to see what debuffs you had. Yeah, no, this doesn't tell me anything! It just... I got I, I got all the details! How do I get details on your conditions, dude? Like, what the fuck does this mean? What the fuck does that mean? This is obviously Frozen, but what the f specifically does Frozen do? Nah. Can I see the number of turns it lasts? Yada 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 you. Why did you get poisoned? Because my guy moved. It does six damage per turn. Okay, where can I see that? Like, in writing. Please. If I'd known they had leap, I in no way would have ever moved. <laughs> this one guy's still frozen. On the upside, I do think they only have one web. At least they only use it once. Oh well, no, they're vulnerable now. If only I could actually use my range. But no, I've fucking bottlenecked them in here. Whoops. Kill. These guys are dead as shit. Can you finish this off? No. Start. Oh, that doesn't just. Yeah, okay. No, I just want to reset the combo. I don't want to watch them flail in the distance. That is an option.
Are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> Just give me a reset up combat anytime option. Come on. Come on! Or at least a surrender immediately and auto battle the rest of it off screen. Not here. Surrender and then wait for to watch your dudes get murdered for 12 turns. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, I didn't get the cool... The, oh, okay, the, well, that sucks. I didn't get the Harvest Festival that gives me extra shit. Boo. That is a lot of food and gold. That actually might be better. Yeah, I can either pay Imperium, I assume at a discount to gain a population, or just get enough food for a population... Oh, but that costs money. I thought that was gain money. Yeah, all right. I'll pay gold for a population. Yeah, at a massive discount. I can't the price. <laughs> oh, except I want the farm there because... Actually, I think if I, even if I turn it to a quarry, it still gets the pastures bonus. It'll just be quarry and then... Why do, I, why do my people hate farms? What the fuck? Like, I could be crafting right now, but instead I'm here killing dirt. Ah! <coughs> Book. Oh, where is the... Oh. Home of Artificing. Siege magic. Iron Golem. See, now that's something cool. What is this one? <laughs> Tome of Winds. Apple. Oh, shit. There's two tier two tomes for each style of crap. Okay, so there's one tier tome of each, I think. And two two tier tomes. Nifty. Surprise Tome of Winds is material and not windy. Gimme. Artifice, I like to think, is the ultimate expression of genius made of How do I see my books? You got books? Oh, this is ready? Shoot, I should have cast this before doing the spider magic. Transform the dwarves into rock and stone. Do I actually get, like, rock parts like the other stuff? Yeah, like the frog lady. <gasps> rock and stone. See, while humans return to monkey, we return to rock and stone. <laughs> Cragmark and Annex. Which is Cragmar want, though? <coughs> Cragmar have anything cool nearby? Cragmar can get sheepies. Which means future people. <laughs> God, why are you so slow? Just because I'm going over tons of difficult terrain? Yeah. Speaking of it, did I keep the, the eagle? Mount? Yes. <gasps> Bird. I did it. I birded up, as the interwebs would say. Can you move faster now? You 
boot walls immediately, you freaking loser. What are you scared of? Knowing that you're trespassing? Does he know? I bet he knows. <coughs> Can I give you anything? <coughs> I kind of want to make him range, because his army has only one technically ranged. The other is a support. But... We also want him to get hit so he does really rolly retribution. Yeah, that that's the words. And if he's getting hit, we want him to have more defense. So yeah, keep that please. Okay, this time now that we know spiders can leap. Did you just go in there alone? No, fucking. Bring your army, dumbass. Yeah, the whole of it, all of it. Beware. You are engaging combat with a high tier unit. Yeah, I know. Unit tiers are shown in the bottom left. I'm surprised you didn't give me this tutorial when I fought the astral creatures that proceeded to lightning my people from like a fourth of the map away. Okay, this time. No. Getting my entire range locked down, stupidly. <laughs> oh, we have a different map now. Is anything slightly more defensible? I think it's actually slightly less defensible. Because <coughs> <coughs> if I put my people back here, then the fuckers can leap. Leave room so the range can get in. Thank you. <laughs> okay, this time. I know what they do. And I cannot fuck it up, even though I'm probably still gonna fuck it up. I could squish against the wall more, so they have no room. Yeah, you know that move here routes. How could I do this? There we go. Now they physically can't get my ranged, although their stupid AoE webs are going to hurt. Is this permanent? This one might be permanent. No. Three turns. Okay. Hang on to that for a bit. This is what we do. We are dwarves. We defend. Oh, you fool! He didn't web. He left it instead. You have made a grave mistake. Kill. All adjacent friendly units gain three resistance. I think I just want to do that. Because I'm going to make everybody but this guy fucking rip him uh, really good against their web attacks. I want to move you over here to kill him if these guys can't. Yeah. 
He will be exposed, but he is also big. Big, big, massive lad. Who I could make even more massive. What does stone skin do? Ooh! Yeah. Kill. Ah, uh -huh. oh, shit, except that exposes my... If they're gonna be exposed, I want it to be this square. If something moves in there, then I can just beat the shit out of it with my three dudes. Or I could sally forth. Is that the only one with leap? That might be the only one with leap. If that's the only one with leap, I don't need to stay here and I can meet them right here. Question is, does it tell me all of their stuff or does it just tell me what I've seen them do. Okay, this guy hasn't gone ever. And I can still see that it does barbed web. So I think the rest of them don't have a leap. Sally forth to meet them, men? I nod. Oh shit, except now they're vulnerable to... I guess it's technically less vulnerable to the webs, because the webs are big-ass AoE, and if we're not bunched up... Ew. Fifteen, 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 ten, ten. And give them two defense or a lot more than two defense. Three defense even. Although this actually heals them. Which might be better off because he's wounded. He's just randomly turning into the graveyard keeper merchant. I don't understand that joke. Ow, we're gonna definitely need to heal him. <laughs> oh fuck, that one's going around! It's fine, we have this defense here. Yeah, that lad. Nice, good, good boy. Um, I just want to kill two of them. Right. So we both attack. I don't think he has a retaliate either. I think if we both attack, we can get that one. Oh, except you can do that one too. Yeah. Wish that spouter. And now just in case we get unlucky and can't finish it off. Nice. And now morale has kicked in. Army losses has kicked in. I don't know why my mind is on Total War today. Probably because it's another strategy game. <coughs> Who are you? these guys. Uh, buff that guy. He's currently being attacked by one, if not two. Duders. Ow. 
And now he's defending, because he might get this guy might get attacked by one, if not two duders. Oh my god, this guy's dying though. No retaliation for you. Thanks. I wanna go try and lock down this dude. I have the feeling that the uh, sword spider over here, whatever it is. It's a melee strike, retaliation, bolstering... Uh, what's your fucking name? Vampire Spider. You got a lot of bleed. Well, I guess that is an empire. Oh, I'm out of spell points. Okay, I need him to retreat. Hmm... All negative status effects. Thought we removed his retaliation because of the this. Unless that removes, yeah. Unless the target has, so that does it to them. Oh well, pig man, big man, right now. Oh no, no. Oh yeah, and he gets retaliated by the by the sweet power of Jesus. Yeah. And then you can get the fuck out. That's all I have right now. Ow. Ow, my shields. Ow, my men's. Ow, my human. Oh no! Oh, I was so close to not losing anybody. Aw. Mm -hmm. oh, no. Ah, <laughs> that doesn't finish it off. Okay, you fucking run. Uh, nearby units will lose morale. Never mind. If you will lose health, why? Boo. How many stacks of bolster do you have? Zero. Cool. Alright, well, he's gonna need strength from steel. Oh, why? Eh, fuck it. Do right. you still have stone skin? I can't give it to him anymore. Pretty sure he can 1v1 this spoder, so. Kill! Kill. Nice, good amount of crits. Uh, you stay there. Cower and run. Now... Ah, damn it! Poison, right. Ow, 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 ow. It doesn't say he's gonna get a retaliation, so I trust you. Okay, we're good. Yeah, beat the corpse a little bit. Why not? Why can't you be affected by that? Weird. Right, well, go be his pocket support. Oh, and we win. Yay! Go pig! See, that wasn't so bad. That was an entire army wipe, just almost half of it. Let's retry that fight. Jeez. How long did that take me? Forever? I got a reward. Magic bolts and a stab. It's magical enemy at the target. No, I'm good.
I guess I could technically turn somebody into... Oh, he's Rocky now. Materium Boon. I do have big... All cities gain 33 stability. Yeah, I have a lot of Materium. Uh, I can take 200, almost $300. Or I can take... Not getting pricked to death. Or... I think I'm probably already close to finishing the armory anyways. I wish I could save this for later. I think I'm going to take the money. $200 is a lot. I can use that $200 to denounce the stupid orc that got it fucking near my thing. <coughs> Asshole. Always end your turn in defensive mode. That's actually really freaking good. Because he that just means he permanently has two defense and two resistance unless something takes him out of it. Shoosh. Or I can give him one defense. Wow, that's terrible. Um. You don't have bolster defense? Bolster defense might be pretty good. But defensive master also... Yeah. I'm immune to flanking. I think that applies... Doesn't that buff the people around me? Alright, um... Back to the town. Now we can afford... Minions. Okay, we definitely need to get you more arbalests this time. <coughs> Maybe a halberder. What does this do? 75, 12, 78. Yes. Where's all my people that are auto pro, uh, auto moving? Stop this! No, bad! No, bad! Quit it! Cease! Yeah, stop! All right. Yeah, guard this. Guard your sack. Whatever. Stop going that way! I don't think they actually are. I think that's just stuck on the screen for some reason. Rock and stone! Out of reach. I have to be rubbing my face against it, which makes sense. Rock and stone! Let's do this one in case it's something cool. Yeah, I think this is... I don't know. Can you... Does this count? I think this, like, will show you what you can dig out. Cool. Okay. I now understand, though, which also means I could have done that with that one scout that I was trying to do it before with. I just didn't know how. Oh, uh, workshop's probably pretty good. We have anywhere that gives me more food. Yes. Skinny. And you're a young babby one, so more food. And we have... A food bordering this somehow? Oh yeah, it's, we're on it. Yeah. Does that count? Do we have that? Multipliers. Domain plus 10. I'm assuming that means yes. Son of a bitch. Hey, <laughs> All right. Was claiming it first. You know what? Fuck 
this guy. Fuck you. And the eagle you rode in on. Oh, wait, you don't have a cool bird friend because you suck. Are to sit there. Gotta look so cool and dwarfly. Mm. And so cool and rock and stony now. Look at my arm. Very rock and stone. Can I remove that? Is that part of this? I don't think so. I think it's just forever there. Yeah. So do I get his city if I take it, or do I just burn it to the ground? Because I will gladly. Digging for treasure, I got an Achievo. City available for negotiation? No, no it's not. I don't know why you keep saying that. It is definitely not, what is this? Gain one Whispering Stone. Uh. Bring an emphasis to cause a free city. Province improvements grant one stability for each adjacent of the type. I don't really have that yet. Is that Board of the Throne City gain nine types of income? I want that one because then that gives Craig. And eventually, once I kill Callus here, a friendship with you was declared. Yay! Rock and stone frog friends! See, we can get along. I like you. I'm not paying $200 for that, though. I'm about to go to war with the filthy blue skins, which are not green skins. No, sorry, purple skins. I'm glad to see our fates intertwining. War! He should have no justification for a war with me, because he settled on my land. Or bordering my land. It is time! Okay, I think his actual, like, hero is fucked off somewhere. Because he used to be running around here, but he probably went home. So, um... First thing thing is first. Bird. Give me your money. You go get more dudes first. You can you can be my reinforcement. And I'm glad to see our fates in fighting. What? Oh, I'm guessing the, the message was Gur Gurar. How dare you border me? Like, bitch! That city was built bordering me! Pay me! Or wait, no, he can pay me. No, no. Fuck you. Fuck you. What do you mean negative 10 alignment? Oh! <laughs> well, how the fuck is this evil? He is tagging me! He is... Poking me! <coughs> <coughs> Alright, here's my plan. I wonder if I need to, like, outweigh his own grievances hard enough. So if I settle this grievance, Jesus Christ, and then I declare war. 
Fuck you. I'll make that back with the war. Very well. If it's war you want, then it's war you will get. I'm sorry. It's war you wanted. I was fine with you staying in your stupid tunnels. That aren't my stupid tunnels. What do you mean my alignment changed to zero? I had a treaty with him? That's fine. I don't care. I don't think I care enough. Kill the bastards. Start siege. You're about to start siege. You must first proceed breach is defensive. Once breached, you can do the thing. Okay. You've started a siege on this city. It takes a number of turns to breach the city's walls, depending on its fortification health. The following assault may be bloody. Oh, I can capture it. What if I don't want to capture it? What if I want to burn it to the ground? Add siege projects. Oh. Undermine the walls. Yeesh. War is expensive. Hello. Fuck off. <coughs> that is all. Thank you. Goodbye. Craig, you need defenses. You know, just in case. That'll do. Does my city have walls? Yes. I think my city start with walls. Because I am imperialist. Counter. Yeah, okay. I thought I already ended my wizard's bond with him. Good to know. Fuck you. In the words of the ancestors, eat a dick. Ooh. Oh, sweet! Leather armor! The first piece of armor this asshole's ever gotten. Oh, wait, did that change my armor there? Hang on. No, it just reset the animation, so it made me look like it does. And I got an achievement called Get Everything Filled. Mm, kinky. I do like people taking damage. But the adjacent allies having stuff is sexy. Ooh. Did you find anything in here? No. I want to, like, recall you and have you come to the war. I think we're fine. Like the pin. Okay, thank you, game. Day 30. Wow, you sure have built a lot in 30 days. That is a lot of arbalists. I thought I was making a halberdier at one point. Yeah. Four range would probably be a lot of damage. Or three range. But also, not a lot. To, you know, four range. 
Not a lot of defense for the range, and the range become absolutely useless if they are not at range. Much like their name says. Or normal size sword. It looks like a big sword. Big sword? Big sword. That's ah, actually kind of eh, yeah, kind of big sword. Do I want big sword? I can't use my bird. No, I do not want big sword. Sadly. I would love to use big sword. Look at it. Deals damage to all adjacent units. That doesn't say adjacent enemies. That could be very, very bad. Bird. Yeah, I think two-handed weapons aren't necessarily more powerful than one-handed. It's just you can move and deal their full damage. But this one deals up to, what? 30, 46, and then 46 plus whatever 8 is. 54? For this one only can ever deal 28. And whatever the hell this is. Total, depending on how many is around them. And also, with one hand of weapons, you get a shield and a sweet bird. Everybody loves a sweet bird. I don't want to go with you. Have I scouted down here? Uh, yes. Or haven't I scouted? Like, all the freaking way over there. Oh, hey. Excavation. Or prospecting. Shin. It's a big ass marauder thingy. <laughs> Where I got my iron golem fell. I want it. I think I can afford the stability hit if I want to cast this on something. That's pretty good if I have a lot of shield units. This army. <coughs> Go with the tools, because I have probably a. Uh, yeah, that's a lot. <coughs> hey, 
Give me a little less stable. For a little more production. <laughs> I don't get the ability to have more cities. Probably just through the thingamadoo. Needed cities are granted three sensing range. Uh, shit through fog of war. Okay. Gain a whispering stone. Increase city capacity. There we go. All right, we need to save it for that. Cuz. This one's not worth it, but, like, somewhere else will be cool. <laughs> Yay! Look at him! He's so big! Red. They took her jobs. Wow, they actually really like that. Look. Oh, I built a bathhouse, which means I got like 40. Yeah, definitely we'll take your jobs. Go to the bathhouse. I wonder if. Wait, I thought I had the wizard's tower a little too. Shit. Yeah, no, I have. Yeah, city income 45. I thought it went zero. I thought it went one, two, three. I have tier one, right? Or is it like Wizard's Tower Foundation? I wonder if this increases Imperium. Or else it literally does nothing. I'm guessing this stacks on top of each other. So it's it'll be Wizard's Tower, Wizard's Tower, Tier 1, Wizard's Tower, Tier 2. And I was wrong when I thought, oh, it's just a dick measuring contest, a tower measuring contest, or whatever. <gasps> I can just make it? I don't have to summon it as a spiel? But I have to summon the Copper Golem then. Because the summon Copper Golem is a summon. Big Man. Stop it. No, wait. No, you do want to be in here. Big Man is a technology. More. More. I need more Golems. That's going to be wonderful. Uh -huh. No, select dude. Go, Craig! Kill! Burn them to the ground! That's a grudgeon! <laughs> ah, nice. Can I sell some of these? That I'm not ever going to use. <coughs> Storage. Uh. <coughs> Sell this. Sell that. I already have a hammer. Frost shield, maybe. Battle axe is cool. Great hammer, we have a better hammer. I afford another golem now. I can. Okay. More golem. In fact, go put a golem in Craig. Can I put a golem in Craig? No, because I can't afford a golem. I'm so close. Yeah. Hey, did you got anything to prospect? I'm here to dig for treasures. This is a huge, whatever you want to call it. Everybody, this area reeks of evil. Uh -huh. It's a place. That's technically correct. Hey. 
Ah, I found the purple people. Do they eat people? How many arms do they have? These are the questions. What happens if I don't want this city? I can probably just abandon it. And I want to get over here so I can get the... The, the sheepies. Cool, that is extras because of river. Nice. <laughs> Walls cannot stop us. That's the name of the achievement I just got. Cool! Probably already damaged too. Because I had just messed up a bunch of dudes. Hello. Nice walls you got there. It's a shame they're a little bit crusty. How the fuck did I lose an arbalist to a skeleton's and some overgrown fruit flies? They don't even have animations on their portrait. Did you just like take these dudes and shove them in? Where they need not be? Like they don't even have like siege towers or or things sh shooting me from back here. Maybe I don't. Maybe they do. I don't know. Why do I need to take out their walls? I have a bird. Why don't I just explode them over? Oh no. Explode! Oh, wrong button. Explode. Careful. That didn't do much. Let me guess. Fairies have resistances. Yes. Several of them. Frog! <coughs> oh. Right. He's a wizard. Alright, that makes sense. The auto resolve was correct. You just nuked my one dude with all of his magic. Which actually, the auto-resolve might be better, because he might just do that again. Although I can't imagine that didn't, uh, take a lot of his magic cast abilities. Kill. Break out the fly swatter. Scooch away from one another so you're not within AoEing range. Skeletons have poison spears? Ew. Cool, nice, good job. Foul necromancy. All right, uh, apparently the auto resolve was better than I am. <coughs> Good job. 
Now what? Vassalize Conquered City. Or raise for money and be evil. Ah. I don't want to be evil. I just don't want them here. <laughs> Absorb. Oh, if I vassalize them, just becomes friend. Okay. Bit. Did it work? Process will complete in one dollar. Okay. Psst. Palisade. Archer. <gasps> Palisade can make an iron golem in eight turns. Never mind. A uh, neat one for yourself, though. <gasps> Big man! Oh, look at him! He's here. He's got a spin stick. He's wonderful! And his head keeps the spinning. Does he shoot lasers out of his head? Is this just a Legend of Zelda Beamos on steroids? It's like, yeah, I don't know why Ganon didn't ever, like, think to put arms and legs on the Beamos. You give it a club or two and send it after a dude, and it just goes to town while also going, pachoo, pachow. You're right, Vadi. You are the better villain. You're so smart. Cannon's over fucking rated. <coughs> Hello. Big man, big man, big man, big man. More. More big men's. Oh, I guess I got money from the battle? No, I, it's because I have 200. Income. Golem mine? Counts as a mine. Spawns an iron golem on the Odin's for combat inside this domain. Counts as a mine. Ten gold. Per adjacent quarry. Hey, that would get me two. Yeah, you get ten more special dollars. Any the weird improvements cost stability, though. Oh, I'm poor. Cool. Set arcane research. More golems. What's this? Skill level four city structure, tome of Erdvising. City gains plenty of fortification health and bolt throwers. Siege magic. It's the enchanted fusion. Unit, $10. Siege Breaker. Demolisher. Or Chuck Rocks at the Bitch. I actually need an offensive spell. So there we go. Man, this is red dude big. Like, it's not even a dude. It's one of those wild marauder things. I don't remember what they're called. It's not letting me click on it to figure it out. Man. Orders required. Uh, can you move after that? Go acquire the big men. Actually, go this way. The big men will come to you. Fuck the trees. All my homies hate trees. Clonk, 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 clonk. Actually, uh... You don't make roads. Founded by Noctis War. Do you not make roads? And yeah, they're gone. Road. Cannot build roads through unaligned domains. It's gonna be aligned pretty dang soon. I hope. That just goes to the nearest city for like spread the round. Hello, purple people eaters. 
thought their city for a moment was named Outpost. Look at you building your little pit. How cute. We should be friends. I'm sorry that happened to your hand. Who didn't prospect this mountain? You guys suck. Oh my god! So many mountains to prospect. Can I just prospect any freaking mountain I want? And like hills and stuff? Evil presence lingers in these lands. Yes! I've been squealing about it this entire time. There's like nothing in this freaking cave. Absolutely jack shit. It is incredibly disappointing. I might just have her go back and start overworld exploring. Or come to the war. <coughs> Hello. Storm orb reforged. Uh, do I want a storm orb? Craig! He's a fragment of the storm orb. The storm orb or a storm orb? Hero is only as good as his weapon. We don't need no wizardry, but I'll take it because it's worth stuff. We can just sell it. Or something. Yeah, you know what? Fuck this place. Let's go back. City has been released as a vassal. Look at him with his brown. You're not purple. You're normal colored. Draco Moon Dagger. What a what a great name. Here, I have a rock. <laughs> Minor tributary in fifteen months. We are days. Vassal in fifteen days. You want the rock? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. <coughs> I do actually get like cool empire bonuses. From being imperial. People. Yeah. Clashing affinities. Don't worry, we'll sort it out, rock and stone. Speaking of trade. I forgot to do that. Oh, I can't trade with Craig. Craig is mine! That makes sense. <gasps> Big man. See? Now you want a road. Roads are nice. Here you go. No, I'm not invading you. I'm roading you. Shit. Can you move for a second so I can road? Alright, fine. Whatever. I'll go around. Enjoy not having a road in the middle of your place. Pfft, losers. Honestly, cities probably come with, like, a whatever amount of hexes and then the middle worth of roads. 30 physical damage. Chug a rock at the bastard. Construct bolt repeaters. Start of the battle, gain two bolt repeaters. Do I just put this on an army and then I get siege weaponry? The whole time? No, it's a siege project. Okay. Yeah. We can use it on a certain city that we're going to get. Instantly gain 2,000 gold. Right. 
I feel like that should be like an ability you can bank or something. <coughs> More shitties. Go, boar boy, go. Actually, I might want to keep them together just in case Mr. Wizard comes out of the woodwork and AoE blasts my ass. Right. Here, kill this dude while we're here. Oh, hi! Alright. Go in peace. Oh, I got food! I didn't realize you got stuff for murdering dudes. I thought you just... fixed the tile. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> you do, like, actually get whatever the hell's related to it. Or I guess there was there was something and sheepies on that tile. Dad, come help me. Grand Mill, Halberdier, Tavern, uh, Craig. Can annex another province. Do I even know what you want to annex? I could eke into Craig and we could hold provinces. Gently. Oh, hey, gold mine! Yes. My lamina has changed to good. Yeah, I don't know why I was evil, because I broke a treaty? I didn't realize I even had that treaty anywhere. I thought it broke when I said I don't want to be friends no more. It was implicit. You started building bullshit on my land. Me no friend. Fuck you. Gold mine. I'm gonna have so much freaking money. Hey, look, money. My god, there's another place I can prospect over here. No, it's not. It's just the border of it, and I'm mistaken. Metalex! Yeah, mountains are really prospect terrific. Just let me summon a spoder. Oh, I want the friend. Can I, can I have friend? I haven't used the taunt yet. Spider. You know who the taunt would be better on? Craig. Because Craig has a lot more taunt related defenses. Here you go, Craig. Enjoy your wand of angry. <laughs> yeah, the fuck is that? I told. Disgusting creature. Ah, oh, sweet additional bird. Cool. I like bird. Bird is cool. Craig, you have been upgraded from boar to bird. Unless boar gives something cool. Very fast movement, flying movement, cavalry unit. Two vision. Can move in any terrain. Requires seafaring. Can move past most other units and obstacles in combat. Or boar. Which is a pig. Bird. Craig, my son. Oh, these guys get fluffy. Your orders are to sit there. Question, if I sit on this underground passage, can he not, like, leave the underground? Because it'd be occupied by something? Because it immediately plops you on there? It might plop him on, like, an adjacent tile. Come, Craig, let us fly like an eagle. Craig, why are you panting? It, you're not even the one doing the work! Oh, there's an iron golem. 
and several smaller baby type golems. <laughs> Here he goes. That was a sound effect, uh huh. Oh, are you not making roads? Does that count as a road? I sure hope so. Hopefully I don't have to re-toggle them to, to, to road hard. <laughs> Every single turn. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be killing the spiders over here. Whoops. Not anymore. Obtain focus crystals. I have a focus crystal. Craig can annex this. It's an iron vein, right? Does it get a bonus if you put the same shit on top of it? Because this one just gives it 10. Yeah, quarry income 5, iron deposit 10. I don't think it matters. Just as long as you have it, bada bing, bada boom. Here you go. Thing. Yeah. Mm. Okay. <gasps> Money. Quick, Craig. Big man. Ooh, a mountain to prospect. This is a cool little valley here. I would build a Minecraft house like. Did it just instantly create? I guess if I've neglected them hard enough, it'll just instantly pop them because I have so much crap. Okay, cool. It's like, please, for the love of God, just build the goddamn shrine. The people, they cry out for religion. How are we supposed to worship the ancestors like this? You're a terrible ruler. Look, I got war and orc story about, okay? I received a tweed proposal. It's a deal! What's this do again? It just means we're friends. Okay, you don't do you, you, you do to me, I won't build near you. I feel like that should be a demand or whatever the heck you can do for somebody like a pronouncement of don't come near me stay over there Willville are you way over there oh are you just shitting out outposts all over the place which is what I should be doing and I haven't been doing, and I said at the beginning of the stream, yeah, I should be doing this more. 
and then I'm not doing it. Like, I should be clearing tons of stuff and just outposting, like, pure. They give you outpost food, it goes into your city. So, outpost here, move it over there. Outpost here, second tile there. Yep, here, other tile there, because you can have up to two tiles. Outpost deer, or skier. <gasps> Big man! Boy, can I just make an entire army that's just iron golems? And just go up and brutalize people with all of the friend shields we're doing? I don't think it stacks. Which would be funny as fuck if it did. That production for bronze gain. Oh, it's not one. It's not in one turn anymore. <gasps> Forge tower. I can make it. I can get a dude man, which is also a tier three shield man, but he has inspiring defense, which gives one bolstered defense. That might actually be a strategy. Six of these dudes, keep them all relatively near each other. Turn one. Four bolster D or six bolster D. No, it'd be five bolster defense on somebody. Turn two, pop the thing that turns bolster defense into melee damage. And then explode a bitch. Industry compound. Provides stability. Province annex range. Oh, there's a maximum range, eh? I want to do the room of recall. And recall the release pledge allows you to sell back to your throne city. That'd be good if they come and they try to mess up my walls. I can just be like, poop, hey, bitch. <coughs> be gone. Ye bugger. <coughs> That's gonna complete both of these in one turn. That's cute. I like that it overflows instead of just wastes it. This was a mistake to bring this army down here. <laughs> we can't move underground because I made the mistake of not making the dwarves an underground race. Because ah! <laughs> I didn't think that was a thing. I thought that would be tied to like a racial thing. Or just something you could select. Because it was something you could just select willy-nilly. It's just, do you want to live above ground or do you want to... Sit in the darkness like I do all day and have a vitamin D deficiency. But no, it's like actually a whole ass race trait you gotta do. Which is dumb. I don't like that change. Because you have to sacrifice, like, whatever the heck my racial physical trait is, which was. I think the bolstering thing, like, every time you get hit, you get one, uh, resistance or defense, which is really good compared to, you live underground. Although the underground thing also allows you to build farms underground, so you technically have, like, double the crap you can, uh, city build on, although you do have a limited number of cities in this, so... Palisade is poor. I'm poor. I wish I had something that benefited from adjacent mines. I just pop it down like right there.
like the copper golems. They look fancy. Um, <coughs> do I want to do another Awaken Tools on Craig? Craig is a good city. It's permanent until I disable it, right? Yeah. Is this the cancel it? No, that's the close the whole thing. How do I get rid of this? What if I no longer like it? large lad. Ahem. Get back. Mmm. Bolt repeaters. Mmm. Undermining. Wait. Headlong assault is... Oh. Units besieging it. Take it. Okay. I thought that was units in the garrison or whatever at forced come large lads I thought that said bronze gate 2 it's like who the fuck built a bronze gate 1 and then renamed my own city to bronze gate 2 oh fuck yeah I want forced march I'm past that. Why can't I take it? It, your line is a little bit funky. It is slightly faster than what I actually got. See, perfect timing. Just in time for the siege. Light, baby. Aww. Light your unit. What does that do? No obvious specializes or counter. They just go in, and they kill. He's actually level two. That's not terrible, actually. Artisan Mermineer. 30% crit chance is pretty freaking nice. Especially if you have a lot of melee units that have... Not that. Whatever the one is that it can multi-strike. Huge magic. I want this one. I want the babies. Wrong one. That doesn't remove it from my other city, right? No. We have taken the jobs via automation from two. Can you not remove these? It says sustain spell. There we go. Okay. That's how you do it. Palisade can annex. Uh, I want Palisade to have the sheepies. But... Palisade does not have access to said sheepies, because I am dumb and didn't clear those out when I had a dude over there. <coughs> However, I could, like, try to bottleneck in Sexy Callus over here. Can I rename you? Since I own you? Aww. could be so much sexier. Hello, some exterior cards of action deeply unwise, boo for, especially if you want to avoid vexing me. Huh? Empires that break treaties. I didn't realize I had a treaty with them, sorry. I forgot. I didn't break a treaty with you, did I? Why don't we have a wizard agreement still? Didn't we do that? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't... Look, it doesn't say wizards bond up here. 
he just has a purple fucking cock ring down there, so I didn't realize, ah, I still have it with him. I didn't mean to, ma'am. I'm sorry. I wasn't having it. You want some flies? I have some pixies that I killed earlier. They're probably delicious and to someone. And someone could be you. <laughs> Delicious in a threatening, non-sexual way. Ah, oh, demon mask. See a chance of gaining despair. <laughs> That's actually probably really good. Uh, does this give me protection? No. How much defense do I have? Ten. I kind of want that. Because his shtick, much like Craig, his son, is to go in and soak damage. And I'm assuming despair is good. Yes. Maybe. Is five morale a lot? Yeah, consuming, considering it's tw negative 20 to 20, negative five is probably some. Oh. No, no, it's not. No, it's at negative 20 they gain low morale. Uh, no, nah, I'm good. You give it to Craig, though. Craig doesn't have a hat yet. Craig! My son! You're not Craig, you're fishy. I have a mask. My scout's jobs are to go around, find mountains, and steal. <laughs> Track a victory condition. Lit. Apparently, I'm doing terribly. Great choice for his protector. Got my face. What are we building Craig? We could build more big men. Forge tower. Didn't I make this? What did I build last turn? Mm. Oh, that was that that that's Craig building that. Yes. Smith's guild. Workers guild. I like how the boost for this is build four farms. When the Farmer's Guild is the one that does four farms. What? It's like, here, build uh, the shit for another guild, and then don't build that guild. Industry compound. There's going to be prospects up here. I just can't see them until I'm on the mountain. Yes. 
That's why Captain Kirk climbed that mountain. <coughs> to find gold. not my big man. Yeah. Okay, uh, can you make it over here in one turn? Maybe? No? And kill this guy. Can I? No. Risky battle. Mm -hmm. These assholes again. Is it just, like, the dog that's making it risky? And the fact that I have only tier 2, tier 1 units? Craig! Didn't you have a, a big man soon? No, but you got this guy. Craig gets a big man next turn, right? Yeah. I'm gonna sit here and glare aggressively at this dog. And by mean, I glare aggressively at the dog. I'm gonna go over here and found an outpost. I can't. I have not twenty-five dollars. And that was not twenty-five dollars. Or more. Why is the unicorn bloody? Because there's literally blood there. He's drinking it. Gross. Hello! Good for the day, Sage Draco the Moon Dagger. I like that name. Phyllis, a lucky little sister, the Sage size. Now she walks with wizards and halflings. Do we even know what a halfling is? She made a baby really crazy with my youngest, hides in damp caves and shoots arrows from cover like a coward. All the while, she thinks herself a lordly as the queens of old. May people favor her, even while I do not. And now she desires to prove her quality. I seek your counsel. Well, prove her. Draft in Bronze Gate will be blocked for two turns. I don't think I am... Do I just get a Orc Lady? Yeah, okay. Mass Rejuvenation. That's pretty nice. Take my Ring of Resistance. Claim it's cursed and send her off to destroy it. Uh, I kind of want the Ring of Resistance. Dang it. Reach vassalage immediately. I wish I could postpone these and like check what his current rate of vassalage is. Um, I don't think I need the draft in Bronze Gate. Whoops. Message received. Uh. Empires with a stronger economy. That is what I'm doing. Summon baby Picanus Dome. I should probably pick something that's not the uh, the material one. But I can unlock some other shit. Founding or absorbing cities takes two less turns. And yeah, free high illusion. Arms grant plus five food. That's actually really freaking good. Or chaos. Give me stuff. Yeah, nature. Mm -hmm. Sacred meadow. Special province improvement. Gains 10 food. Five stabilities if adjacent to a conduit. Grains encouraged. Cancel the farm. Build on thingies. And I gain forest people. 
leaf skin. That doesn't seem very... Okay, camouflage, maybe. <gasps> Can I get big tree, dude? I want big tree, man. Big tree man's cool. <coughs> What's the other one? Temple of Fertility. <laughs> I think I want the one that gives lots of food. Stability is good. Stability is additional food. Okay. Give me the wood book. There is vigor in the verdant leaf. Might in the branch. Oh, yeah. This gets me a tier 3 Blessed ranged unit, too, so I can upgrade my, um... And let this verdant uh, emerald blanket unfurl over the land. Such... Select! Okay, good. I can upgrade my arbalists. Yeah, a little bit leafy, but mm, we'll let it slide. Money! Yay! Why not? Order, sir. Become one with the bird. Wait, no. It ran past the bird. All right, what do you got? You're getting that. You are exploring down here. And you are getting this. And you are getting this. And you are not getting that. You are getting... I should probably do the halberd and the thing too. Um, You and you. Be gone. Hang out. Invest your Imperium. Any infestation of conquering a free city. I don't think I even want that. Like, I am beyond that point just a little bit. I would love to invest it, but you won't let me. Gain one siege project slot. Siege projects cost 25% less. Or gain money! I like how I besmirched this before going, I could just make gold, but $2,000 it is. Sounds really good right about now. Although, city structures costing 20% less gold. Sounds even better. Give me. <laughs> Do I have to refund my other stuff? No, it automatically did it, I think. Maybe. <laughs> I don't think I had exactly 150 gold when I looked up there earlier. <gasps> Ooh, a different biome. Neat. It's fun. Quesis. Leg. Ring. Nothing. I do orb and a shield? No. You're very smitey, though. You're like, that, that's your shtick. He's got the smiting ability for things that attack him. They, he, he touches them right back with the power of Jesus. And he bonks them on the noggin with the power of Hazel. I like how I haven't even seen their lord coming to try and help any of their cities over here. Unless he's going to suddenly appear here and mess up my day. Do I want to go for Dream Vault? And just nip him in the butt entirely? I was just going to kick him off of the surface. Good job, Craig. Oh, this one.
Spell jammer. That's not a boat. Sacred metal. Oh, yeah, I need to build that in the other place. Counts as a mine. Um, what is this one? This is adjacent quarries, right? I don't think I have that there. I have no quarries there. <laughs> Counts as a farm. Adjacent conduit. I don't think I have any conduits here either. I have a conduit there. I could make this into the farm. Convert this into a conduit. And then slap the sacred meadow down. Might be one of the few places I can do that, because you need a magic thing for a conduit. And those are kind of rare. Is that going to convert it to a farm? We may never know. Maybe it'll just stay a mine, but also count as a farm. At the same time, that'd be kind of interesting. You can double up with those. Two big guys. I don't see how I can lose this. Or, well, not lose, but lose a person in this. I have more than double their people. Yes, and two heroes. I want to see the, 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 the big men in action, though. Let's watch. Go, big men! Oh, there's three of them. They're so big! Does that actually mean that they scale better um, in losing HP? Because, like, say you have a unit of shields that's six dudes. So for every six of their HP, they lose a six of their offensive power. For these guys, would be only be every third. And they would lose a third. Yeah, I'll waste all of my mana, why don't you? I got 900. If I could pay mana to make stuff, I would. Oh, oh my god, those are nice. Holy shit, dude! Rith Skellington. Rith those wizards. Oh my god, those are nice. If you see the opponent building those, give up! Sadly, I don't think uh, with industry I can get cannons and tanks in this. But I can get cool golems and stuff. Uh, in three, there is a like type of research you can get, whatever the hell you want to call it, that lets you get literally like tanks and guns and stuff and cannons. However, uh, in the season pass for four, it looks like those are going to be added as a DLC, which I think they were a DLC in three, along with necromancers. Although the 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 you kind of half get necromancers in this. If you go shadow, you can resurrect undead. But like in three, there was necromancers that just had whole undead cities and ruled as like lich kings and stuff, which was neat. That is not, however, included in, in any of the preview like season pass. This is what we're doing stuff for this game. So I wonder if that's going to just be thrown in somewhere, somewhere. Uh, Shrek. Shrek. 
And then the dragon people are in are playing for DLC for this. Fucking wreck. Oh. They bonk so hard. That's some good bonk. He just desperately tries to whittle down one of my archers. Do we need to bolster defense? <laughs> when they're just about to die. You know that cost me spell points, right? And it did nothing! <laughs> Dying. Help. What do I do with this city? I can vassalize it. I can kill. Which gets me 20 evils. Which I only have 10 goods. And I want to stay good. Because... Frog lady likes me. And I want to figure out what that tongue do. <laughs> Forget I said that. Stop. No. Bad. Unit needs orders. You have orders. Go over here. <laughs> mana income unlocks the big giant head. Do a room of recall. Just in case. For when I conquer what's his face, I can just poof back here. Ooh. Volcanic. I need to go into some of these. Because I probably can with my army of big men's. And my eventual ability to get... Where my research? Where, where, where? Do I say that? Is it this one? Is it this one? That one. Huh? Eh? Eh? Huh? Oh! I'm an idiot. Yeah, once I get like three shield units, or two shield units, and then three glade runners, uh, that's gonna be entire armies of tier three units, which is probably real nice. I don't know if units go above tier three or not. Probably! Considering those come from tier two research books, and there's probably tier three, if not higher than tier three. I don't know how many tiers there are. Hopefully there's more, because I like this game, and I want there to be more of this game. trade mana for stuff. I'm happy to do that. I wish I could trade it in bulk instead of per turn, but whatever. Alright, I'm gonna have him sit there this turn so he can wait the fuck up for my man. Meanwhile, you, I forgot to do this next turn, or last turn, shit. Did I? I don't know. Kill. Still risky? But big man. And halberd man, which will kill the shit out of this guy, right? I would assume that is big, large, huge wolf. What does auto combat give me? Uh. Death. Ow. That's not.
Once again, that probably came from them just charging like a dumbass. Ah, fuck. Well, luckily they only have one ranged unit. Big man. Oh, I love how they look. They look fucking awesome. that in the middle. Hold on. Yeah. Big man. Should actually do this instead. I don't want to move her there, because she has the halberd. She gets, like, three attacks of opportunity, so if they try to run past into the arbalest, they'll just get pinpricked very hard. throw now. Rocks fall, you die. That does not do a lot. That does even less. I'm going to save it for now. Ow. 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 Yeah, I get the first strike, losers. And pinned, I guess. Uh-oh. No, you're supposed to do that to her. Wrong side! Yeah, I get the first strike, loser. Oh, you got sundered. Get sundered, loser. Get bolstered, loser. Get pinned, loser. Um... Save my boy. Shoot. Kind of want to try and focus down one of these dudes. Well, it was damage. You didn't even point it the right way. There you go. I got one of them. Yeah, you, you touch him real good. Meanwhile, bonk. <laughs> You're so big. Actually, they're probably, like, normal man size. <laughs> we are dwarves. These are probably just the size of, like, large humans. And I'm sitting here going, ha <laughs> ha, big! And they're not. <laughs> oh, shit! The halberd is a two-handed weapon that deals extra damage. Nice. If I do this and get him down real low... Ow. If he attacks me, I... He might die from the damage from it. And I'll first strike him. So if he attacks me, I get the first strike, and I think it just kills him. How exactly do I lose this? They figure out that this guy can spam chain lightning or something? Because <coughs> he sucks. 
That is not even something good to attack. You could have tried to focus my range down. I'm not complaining, but I'm just saying. Oh, oh, oh no! That's it, that's how he lose. Oh no! Oh, He broke one of my toys. Shame. Uh-oh. Yeah, haha! -ha. Get first strike, bitch. Okay, um, here's how we do this. No retaliation for you. Get the fuck away. Ah, uh, duty. Can you move more than one? I just have to take the damage first and then move the rest? Pinned. Mm. See, I would love to know what pin does, but you don't give me descriptions anywhere. At least anywhere that's easy to find. Where? Oh, I, I fucking really? Over the name? Pinned is probably you can only use one move. Oh. oh. I just thought I took a if I went through that. No. Here, uh, don't die. Meanwhile, fuck, ow. That's not even my rage, dude. That's vulnerable. Although they are trying to, to, to burst down my duder, which is not good. I need him. Yeah. Don't miss. Fuck. Rip trees, damn. the birds. Birds take more damage. He has an even better adjacency bonus. Don't die! Please, he's dead. No, my baby. Wait, 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 wait. Damn it. My big man! Oh. <laughs> oh, well, I tried. Now you get to die. Wait, hang on. <laughs> <coughs> Right in the Grendel. Oh, yeah. Big. Throw rocks at him! Yeah! Finish him off with the rock! Woo! Rock and stone! Aww. 
Big Iron Boy is gone. Well, at least it's not the entire army. Does it get me this, or do I have to outpost it? I probably have to outpost it. I guess that'd be fine, because then I can outpost that next to it. Sure, why not? I need to do more outposts anyways. Do any of you guys want to come back? We have lost some good automated lads today. I don't know if they were sentient or not, but actually. Stop it. Christ, you can come out of here too. Kill. Kill? Kill. Kill? 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 Oh, come on. So close. You guys move? Yes. Whoops. Oh, right here now. The Merchant's Guild, which is money. I have two mines only, though. But that could change. I could change this quarry into a mine, I think. No. And I don't know why. Where is my other mine? I have a gold mine. Or a gold M. Wait. Does this count as two mines? I don't think I have two mines. Yeah, no. That's not a, a mine with a builder's quarry on it. That's just a builder's quarry. Where's my other mine at? Oh, well, all the way out here. Okay. Um... Still 10 gold per mine, right? Yes. And I don't quite see the appeal of the Workers Guild. Because, like, yeah, it'll let you... Oh, well. This turns production to gold. 25% of production. So in order for this to equal two gold mines, I would need eight quarries. And also be needing to generate gold. Which I'm not if I'm building anything else. the sacred meadow there because then I can put a farm here and here and it gains big adjacent wait no fuck right that doesn't get adjacency for being a farm or for farms that gets <laughs> stop that gets adjacency is for the garbage <coughs> conduits still I'd rather have a farm there anyways uh, 10 food, city stability, if it is I don't want that. Counts as a condo. Hey. I can just force it to count as a conduit. And maybe I can get another one at some point and do the thing. He gets. It's something. At least it will count one, and I'll get five stability, which will offset half of De Tooker gerbs. Hmm, <coughs> spooky. I like the lava flows. It's... You already had your orders. Stop being greedy. Leave some for the rest of us.
No. Don't want to give you orders. Go away. Learn to swim in lava or stop. Yeah, fuck you. And hey, we want to wait on. Sometimes it just do be like that. That's a lot of squiddos. Was Age of Wonders 3 the ones that had the Naga faction that you could slap on water? No, that was, uh... Oh, Warlock. Those crystal the crack to the toilet retreats to his forge. At nightfall, he returns to you with the Storm Orb. Okay, a Tier 3 Magic. <coughs> this effect jumps to another enemy within two hexes and can jump two more times. I'm thinking I put that on somebody, because that's stupidly good. And it also goes up to three times, so I can do 30 damage. To four units? Is this jumps to another enemy and then an additional two times after that, or jumps to two total? Kind of want that. That's stupidly good. Train XP. Gains enough experience to rank up. That might be worth it. Own your smithing skills. <laughs> Craig! Enjoy your new ball. It's yours, my friend, as long as you have enough rubies. And he did. Ah, uh, but Craig is supposed to be like a big... Do, do fucking hickey, do fucking, yeah, that. Retaliator, dude. Can I respec him? Can I make Craig a wizard? Yeah, there's no hero types in this one. Just whatever you shove on them. I could make him into a wizard. He can touch his ball all he wants. From his bird! Holy crap, that's actually really good. Does flight mean he can't be hit in melee? If so, he can't be locked down. Alright, Craig. I don't know how many times I can do this, so I'm gonna, like, save first. <coughs> I had the feeling there's, like, one free respec. Or maybe I can just reset skills willy-nilly. Craig, you are now a wizard. Enjoy. Magecraft. Uh, ignore up to one status resistance, which would be good for the ball. Hey, look! Even lightning! Here you go. Which does the exact same thing that your orb does. With an AoE. Sunder resistance would be good. Fuck, I didn't mean to do that. No, stop, bad, cancel. Alright, Craig. You are now Dwarf Wizard. Enjoy. Channel power. Magic attacks gain 80% damage until the end of the next turn. The magic attack. It says magic bolts. I'm assuming that's magic. Is magic the kind of attack or the damage type? I'm assuming it's magic attacks. So damage types that are magic. <coughs> Does it also count as range? No, physical range. Can I get one that has magic range? Gains regeneration. What I do? Will they gain 10 now and 10 later, or 16 now and lose 6? Hmm. 
Golem Assistant. Start combat with an Iron Golem Tier 1 Fighter Unit. Just free? It's only Tier 1, but look at the baby. <coughs> Wizard. <coughs> <coughs> Lightning Evoker sounds cool. Channel Power sounds cool. I had to select it first. Wait, what's happening? Hold on. Fuck. Could... Mm. What is going on? Yeah, this is a little bit buggy. I think it's supposed to, like, highlight it or remove it from this list, but it's not... Ah, okay, I see. Now it costs money. Fun part. Fire evoker, no. Maybe, no. Give me this. Give me the distance. Here's a magic tag, yeah? Can I get lightning evoker? I think it already does. There, that is your shtick. Arcane Strength. Damage and Accuracy. Yes. Wasp Evoker. So you've been a chance to inflict Frozen. Yeah, that's pretty good. And it's a cone. Like, cone as in... Yuh? Like triangle or cone as in middle and then everything around it. I want the baby. I need three more points to get the baby though. Yeah, that's all physical and stuff. I want to do channel power. I kind of want to do defense for if they try to shoot him out of the sky. <gasps> I can change this too. What do I got? Visions of woe. One hex radius. Fumble their next attacks. Damage reduced by 50. Or. I mean that melee damage. Oh. Can I give that to somebody? I think it's only usable on himself, hence the zero range. Or explosion! Diseases or undead. Kind of want Virilian Outbreak. Because A, sounds neat. B, more leaf. And I do want more leaf right now. I think the healing is good. <coughs> Maybe experience leader? I kind of just want to go and roll one of them so I can get the cool golem assistant. Yeah, one hex radius is the center and then everything around it. I don't know how cone does. Especially a three hex cone. So is it just three adjacent tiles? What? Special all your cooldowns and once per combat abilities. Do I get any more stuff unlocked if I put more points into this? Because like I didn't see Frost Evoker until it showed up and I put stuff in it. But I can see other stuff, like it's uh, all this. Precision trading. Accuracy is probably good. That's also probably good. I'm gonna go with being a wee bit more healthy, or this one. Healthy? I don't wanna go with true sight. Although, I can't imagine the game would fuck you over so hard as to have invisible units that you can't target, but can beat the snot out of you in combat. And next turn, we get Baby. 
Yeah, oh, that's a lot of skills to reset. <laughs> it's free once, and then it costs an arm and a leg. All right, we need to make you into a wizard. It's, the, the bird is a little bit cuddly, though. How wizardly can we make him? Well, first of all, uh, outfit. You got a wizard outfit you can have? No. Because that's as wizardly as we get. How about a wizard helmet? No. There's no such thing. Wizard cape? No, no such thing. Industry does not have wizard. Alright, whatever. Well, enjoy your orb. It's cool. And with that, I have to go. It is 11 o'clock. <gasps> but there's stuff to do. Next time, if there is. I will be back tomorrow with something. Huh. I'm going to send you out of Tokyo. Thank you very, very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, good fuck it. Yeah. Where is Toki? Unless Toki is taking this Thursday after. Nope, there he is. He's currently playing The Fucking Sims. The original. Let's go watch his torment. See ya.